In this tutorial, I will show you the basics for assembling a layered cake topper cut by Cricut. For this project, I use lightweight 65 pound cardstock for the colors and a medium weight cardstock for the black because that's what I have on hand. I glue together the first two layers because of how the layers work together and for stability. Use a good quality paper glue with a precision tip to help with the thin areas and apply glue lightly. Cardstock only needs a small amount of glue to stick well. I am using reverse tweezers to help move and place cardstock. These are really handy because they do not need constant pressure to stay closed. Adjust the layers quickly while the glue is still wet. For the top black layer, I added small pieces of double-sided adhesive foam, which can be cut to size with scissors. Adhesive foam adds extra dimension to your cake topper projects by adding space between layers. As you are designing cake toppers, be sure to consider how you want to secure each layer. The foam needs more room than glue. With all the foam in place, remove the backing to prepare the cardstock to be secured on top of the glued pieces. I probably overdid it a little with the amount of adhesive foam, but I wanted to be sure the cake topper is strong. I realized here that I needed to remove a piece of adhesive foam from the letter T to make room for the cake topper stick. Use hot glue to add the stick and then place the top layer. The adhesive foam gives enough space for the cake topper stick to fit in between the layers. Here I used a clear acrylic lollipop stick. Give your cake topper a check to make any alignment adjustments and that everything is sticking well. And that's it! Your topper is ready for your next celebration.